In a world increasingly concerned about environmental, social, and governance ESG, factors, sustainable reporting standards have become essential for organizations to communicate their commitment to sustainability, transparency, and responsible business practices. Three prominent frameworks that guide sustainable reporting are the Global Reporting Initiative GRI, the Sustainability Accounting Standards Board SASB, and the International Integrated Reporting Council IIRC. In this video, we will explore these standards, their key differences, and their collective importance in promoting sustainability and responsible business behavior. 1. Global Reporting Initiative GRI. Background. Founded in 1997, the GRI is one of the oldest and most widely adopted sustainability reporting frameworks globally. It provides a comprehensive set of guidelines for organizations to report on their economic, environmental, and social impacts. Key Features Comprehensive Reporting GRI focuses on transparency and accountability, encouraging organizations to report on a wide range of sustainability indicators, from greenhouse gas emissions and energy use to labor practices and human rights. Global Applicability the GRI framework is designed to be adaptable for organizations of all sizes, sectors, and geographical locations. Materiality. GRI emphasizes the importance of identifying and reporting on material aspects, which are issues that are significant to an organization and its stakeholders. Stakeholder engagement. It places a strong emphasis on engaging with stakeholders to determine the materiality of issues and the scope of reporting. Two. Sustainability Accounting Standards Board SASB. Background The SASB was founded in 2011 and focuses on industry-specific sustainability reporting standards. It provides guidelines tailored to the unique ESG risks and opportunities of different industries. Key Features Industry Specificity SASB standards are designed for 77 specific industries, ensuring that reporting is relevant to an organization's sector. Financial materiality. SASB's approach is centered on financially material ESG factors, meaning it focuses on aspects that are most likely to impact a company's financial performance. Integration with financial reporting. SASB standards are designed to be incorporated into an organization's financial reporting, making it easier for investors and analysts to assess ESG risks. Disclosure and Metrics SASB provides disclosure topics and key metrics that organizations should consider reporting on based on their industry. 3. International Integrated Reporting Council IIRC. Background IIRC was founded in 2010 and focuses on integrated reporting, which seeks to combine financial, environmental, social, and governance information in a cohesive and concise manner. Key Features Integrated Reporting IIRC promotes the integration of financial and non-financial information into a single, coherent report, providing a holistic view of an organization's value creation. Stakeholder Capitalism IIRC's approach aligns with stakeholder capitalism, emphasizing that businesses should consider the interests of all stakeholders, not just shareholders. Value Creation Integrated reporting highlights an organization's value creation process, acknowledging not just financial capital but also human, intellectual, social, and environmental capital. Forward-looking perspective. It encourages organizations to include information about their future strategies and how they intend to create and preserve value. Key differences and complementarity. Scope. GRI covers a wide range of sustainability aspects while SASB is industry-specific and focused on financially material issues. IIRC seeks to integrate these aspects into a cohesive narrative. Stakeholder Engagement GRI and IIRC emphasize stakeholder engagement for determining materiality, while SASB considers materiality from a financial perspective. Integration with Financial Reporting SASB is explicitly designed to integrate with financial reporting, 
whereas GRI and IIRC do not provide the same level of guidance for this integration. Complementarity. These frameworks are not mutually exclusive. Organizations can use GRI, SASB, and IIRC standards in combination to provide a more comprehensive and tailored view of their sustainability performance. Importance of Sustainable Reporting Standards Sustainable reporting standards are critical for several reasons. Transparency and accountability. They promote transparency, enabling stakeholders to assess an organization's sustainability practices and hold it accountable. Risk management. Reporting helps organizations identify and manage ESG risks and opportunities, which can impact their long-term financial performance. Investor confidence. Investors increasingly consider ESG factors in their decision-making, and standardized reporting makes it easier to assess and compare companies. Stakeholder engagement. Reporting frameworks encourage organizations to engage with their stakeholders, promoting dialogue and collaboration. Long-term value creation. Sustainable practices are often associated with long-term value creation and resilience in an evolving business landscape. In conclusion, sustainable reporting standards like GRI, SASB, and IIRC play a vital role in the global shift towards responsible and sustainable business practices. While these standards have distinct focuses and approaches, they can complement each other, allowing organizations to tailor their reporting to their specific needs and circumstances. As the demand for ESG information continues to grow, these frameworks will remain essential tools for organizations looking to communicate their commitment to sustainability and ethical business behavior.